Hello, Your Honor. Welcome now to Tuesday, and thanks for logging in. Sunny nesting and resting today for the judge and juries of the Zodiac. The moon is in Capricorn, so that's putting emotional focus on your grounding and your self-mothering. Now, the moon is off Pluto, so I don't think there'll be so much drama as there might have been yesterday, but it is a good time to invest in your feelings of security and your feelings of self-nurturing and self-mothering. If nothing else, Libra, this is the perfect time to clean the house, okay? You'll find that it makes you feel a lot better. Zip into the sun. We're in chapter two of Sun in Aries. This month, the Librans are working on their long-term relationships. Today, Neptune is ruling the day. That means today's a day of logging in, being intuitive, and connecting to your higher self. So the topic, of course, is your LTRs. Maybe there's an issue. Maybe there's a block. Maybe it's you. Is it him? Is it her? These questions need to be answered. If you don't know how to meditate, check out Julie Zephyr yesterday. She was actually doing a new meditation vibration on the Aries topic. And in your case, this will help you directly with connecting to your higher self. So ask your guides for the guidance of what to do in your LTRs. Then zip into Mars. Mars is showing it's time to take action, Libra, when it comes to you and the world. Time for you to get out there, do your politics. Time for you to be the socialite you want to be. This was on hold for a very long time. Mars was retrograded for some time from Christmas until about last month, a couple weeks ago. Finally, though, it's starting to get a little traction in Chapter 1, and it is showing that there will be some breakthrough activity or wisdom coming from you moving ahead in your social plan. So I highly recommend you become that socialite. All right, Libra, that's all I have for Tuesday. But I'll be back tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So God. Done.